Hello ladies and gentlemen, today I would like to talk about PDFixer's program, a little utility that pretends to be just a file converter. However, after its installation you may have noticed that your browser's behavior has changed. There are strange pop-ups in the system and overall, a lot of things do not work as they should. In this video, I will explain what the PDFixer's program is, why it is dangerous and how to remove it. Let's begin with understanding what PDFixer is about. As I said, it is advertised as a file converter, a program that allows you to convert files from one format to another. The first problem here is that it simply does not work. It instead drops a file reader program, an open source app called Sumatra PDF. It is a legit app which still cannot convert the file, that it is main purpose is to open the files of different formats. But it is not the end of the story. In fact, this open source thing is the most legit part about what is happening. Besides installing a different program instead of its own solution, PDFixer's application delivers several other programs, ones that fall under the designation of Browser Hijacker. Users particularly complain about a thing called Media Arena, or PDF Power. The latter installs the former as an advertising module. We've published a video about them earlier. It alters the default search engine into the go-to search power online.com, which mimics Yahoo but floods the results with various advertisements. These ads are much more dangerous than they look, as they can casually throw you to a phishing or scam website. What's more disturbing, though, is that PDFixers itself is often spread in software bundles with various freeware. This puts it in the line with unwanted programs and even malware. There is an official website where you could have gotten PDFixer before, but now there is no download button on it, and the site is effectively just an empty page. Even though this program itself is not harmful, other unwanted stuff that comes together with it can create a mess. With that being said, it is time to talk about how to remove PDFixers and all the unwanted stuff that may come with it. Manual removal is not a great option, as the sheer volume of junk were will likely make it a several hour long endeavor even for a skilled user. With Gradient Soft and Time Malware, on the other hand, you will be able to remove all this in just a couple of clicks. Run a standard scan, it will go through all the places that unwanted programs typically inhabit. After the scan, click Clean Out to remove the detected stuff. It is normal for unwanted programs to create a lot of files on the disk, so the removal may take some time as well. Now the system is clean. Good luck and stay safe online.